I had a bowl shaped pond and now I want to layer it up so I can put things like plants or potted plants on the sides of it. Um, so this way you can see I've created a bit of a mess here because I've just removed all the rocks, all the plants and um, starting again basically. And if you look up here, this is where my waterfall comes down. Um, I plan to uh, basically clean all this out as well. It hasn't been cleaned for many years and it just needs a good clean. Um, so I'm going to start at the top. We want to start at the top because you know, the water falls down so we can start at the very top and just work our way down. I'll come back to this later on. One of the first things I need to do uh, for this pond is fix this, this spot here. You can see that um, the problem is that we have dirt coming in because this liner isn't set up correctly. So what I'm going to do here is put some soil behind here and then uh, level off like that and maybe put some rocks up there so it'll just prevent dirt coming in on top of here like you can see there. Okay, I've put the dirt in here behind there. I've made a little bit of a shelf there. That way I, as I build the wall up I can put rocks at the top just here in the shelf and that'll just help prevent some dirt going in. Next job that I want to do is uh, get rid of all this dirt here so I'm going to first use a broom just to sweep from the top and down into there and then I'm just going to collect all the dirt and get rid of it. Right, at this point I've cleaned most of it from here up and I'm ready to go and uh, use a, a high pressure gun to go and uh, clean all the dirt out of the rocks and get the algae off the rocks as well. Okay, I've cleaned the pond out at the top here. Uh, the next step I need to do is set these uh, platforms here. Um, so there's a product called foam sealant here, which is for ponds. And the idea is that uh, I've got a few rocks here where I want to place it down. I'm going to use this foam to put it in the rocks and just set that platform on top of it. So it will just sit there nice and tight. is to make sure it's all uh, clean, which I've done before. Hi, so I've cleaned all the pond liner and I've also cleaned all the rocks. Uh, I've also put in the two platforms there and I've used foam as I showed you before, put them in. So now I'm ready to add the rocks back in and uh, just finish it up there. Okay, what I've done here is I've just started with, the, I've got the biggest rocks and I've put them sort of closer to the middle here. You can see from the bottom, I start from the bottom and I went up. Uh, 
So now the plan is I've got some smaller pebbles that I'm going to put down the middle so that'll just stabilize the bigger rocks initially and then when I've, I've added that then I'll add the smaller rocks just above the bigger ones there. So here I've got some um, white marble chips from Home Depot and I'm going to start from the bottom here Okay, you can see here we've done the middle section with those white marble rocks. Uh, the next step is to move uh, the smaller rocks to the sides. We want to cover all the black liner so it just looks nice. So here we have it. We've just finished putting all the rocks there, we cleaned it up and that's the finished product. Hope you like it.